This video demonstrates how to receive pin numbers for connector and how to create a snapping counterpart. To assign uh, a pin connector, go to the panel interface, menu library, parts, tab, define connector. In the opened menu, item set pin faces, put a tick in front of rectangular pin. Then specify the direction and the edge of one of the contacts and assign him a number. After, click next pin and do the same operation with the next contact. We make a check. Tab define connector select path. Specify the pin and then we see display of our contacts. To create a snapping contour path from two connector, connectors, at first it's necessary a signal, uh, to assign them a position in space relative to each other. That is, you must assign coordinate system for each part, where there will be the points of snap. snap. Uh, for this, go to panel interface, menu library, tab paths, define clamps. Select the first connector and then specify the snap point and the direction of the coordinate system. Next, do the same action with the second connector. And uh, it's important to find a such snap point that uh, when connecting parts were exactly attached that the surface don't intersect uh, with each other. Then go to the mini model and tap modify position. Uh, select uh, the first part. And choose in the position menu method other by ref cs. Specify the snap point of the first part, then snap point of the second element. Now uh, go uh, back to the menu table interface library snap parts snap in coordinate system. In the opened menu, specify the first and second connectors and click OK. In order to add these parts in library, you must save each connector with snapping CS in the package format in the directory where is stored information about of connectors library. We also need to create an image of our connectors to display on the icons in the library menu. We use the program Snagit to create an image. Choose fixed region with the size of uh, 100 on 100. It's the size of icons in the library and click Capture. Save the image in the library catalog in the BMP format. And uh, then do the similar operation for, for the second connector. Then open the file catalog, which is located in the folder library parts connectors in the system directory. We need to add the objects in the directory. Uh, to simplify the task, copy the string with a description of any component and put down in the list. Replace the names for the first connector and for the second. 
Each string describes the path uh, to the image of the objects in BRP file and its model, its PKG file. And then save uh, the library file under a new name, catalog new, in the format CCF. On the panel interface library, select set current connector uh, library, select file. Specify a new directory to which you will access the library. Choose one of the newly saved components, for example this. Choose in the interface library more uh, open a load counterpart, snap in, and select the connector. As a result, counterpart for this part is added automatically. 